in six nights with nothing more than two canteens of water, an MRE cookie, and a pair of MVPs on the wall. If that was what he had with him. So you have a niece, a daughter, a wife, a dog back home, your mom, your dad, whoever it is, right? That's going to be your thing to focus on. MTX is the entire battalion going up into some pretty hard weather conditions and terrain and learning how to operate at the individual level all the way up to the battalion level. If you're trying to boil water, right, you're trying to shave off that time and you don't bring your water all the way to a boil and all of a sudden you catch Girardia. Survival night was uh, something interesting not a lot of people get to do. So was, that was definitely an experience, living off a of bare minimum for a night. With the cold weather, there's a few extra things you have to consider other than just the enemy. If you are considered combat ineffective, then obviously you won't be able to fight the enemy. Our first company tactical movement down the mountain where we had to go and secure an LZ, it was good to have the whole company working together in each individual platoon. I think Bridgeport is a good place for this training because of all the elevation change and it brings in all the cold weather elements that the Marine Corps is looking for for the Marines to be trained up on. For myself and 3-6, once we leave here at the end of February, we'll be going down to 29 Palms in California and doing a ITX with two ranges.